Well, it was a big surprise for me um, initially. Like, uh, there's so many well-respected guys in the group, and I guess to be appointed as a captain is a real honour. So, um, yeah, as much of a surprise as it was, it was a it was a big thrill. So I'm looking forward to it. Are, have you adjusted pretty well? Are you are you pretty much ready to go for the game? I mean, in my in my role, I am. Um, I know what I have to do, but if you had to ask me a rule or something, I probably couldn't quote it to you. So <laughs> I'll just stick to what I know, and and um, yeah, I'm really confident. What's your impression of the other team captains that were selected? Um, yeah, they're great uh, role models, and they're uh, they're guys that I looked up to when I first got here, and I still do now. So um, we're in really good hands with the other three guys, and um, they're obviously stars on the field, and um, hopefully we can we can all work together to help the young guys out. Was there something in particular you did that kind of garnered the respect of others really quickly? I don't think so. I think I just um, brought my own personality to it and uh, tried to get around as many guys as I can. Um, and then just try and do as well as I can on the field. So hopefully that builds respect and um, yeah, hopefully we can get off to a good start. The accent helped too. Uh, it was actually uh, worked against me a couple of times. I've had to repeat myself a few times. So <laughs> uh, I'm sure Tom would have um, been experienced that as well. But um, yeah, it's good having an accent and being different. I guess. <laughs> has Tom given you pointers about the rivalry? He has. Yeah, he's uh, he's done a lot for the rivalry, I guess. And um, yeah, just have to go back a couple of years when he was on stage and. Mm -hmm. Sort of gave him a bit of a send off, so it's uh, it's a real good game uh, in this town, and I can't wait to uh, to be a part of it. Are you following the the basketball at all, the World Cup stuff? Uh, 